there's a clear wish, both from local people and decision makers, to return cities to their citizens and to bring back the quality of city life. With that in mind, lighting products are not only perceived as functional lighting points, but also as urban furniture, a part of the city landscape. Lighting points must contribute to the beauty of the city, enhancing the architecture and creating a pleasing ambience. So the aesthetics of the luminaires become as important as their technical performance. Therefore, luminaires, masts and brackets must form a coherent system with consistent design and perfect integration. We help to improve livability for inhabitants and enhance the identities of cities with light. In our co-development program, we create, together with cities, designers and energy companies, meaningful lighting solutions to reach this goal and bring creative ideas to life. A co-development between a manufacturer and a light designer can be very fruitful because we are looking from two different perspectives on the development process. The lighting manufacturer um, has his high skills in the production process and in his sales knowledge. We, on the other hand, as independent lighting designers, uh, are interested in the project. So we want a product which is very adaptable and flexible uh, in terms of the project and uh, is good looking and very functional. So when these two perspectives are aligned, come together, we end up with a product for the customer, which is um, easy to use, available uh, in a good price, but adaptable on his project. The members of our co-development team with Philips have different professions, lighting designers, construction engineers, industrial designers, economists, marketing people, even users. Uh, this is a big advantage and at the same time a big challenge. We all had to communicate a lot and to work hard until everybody was satisfied. However, this is the best basis uh, for innovation from my point of view and for a product which integrates the requirement of a modern city. We came to the first presentation with three different designs and Urban Sky was selected by ENBW and Philips and further developed. It's a suspended luminaire for street lighting based on the new uh, legend module by Philips. We were challenged to find a shape which is timeless but still very unique and sympathetic. Urban Sky is uh, environmentally very friendly from the design and production point of view because there are no compound parts, there are no glued parts and each single part can be assembled and replaced. So after the first uh, concept, uh, general concept was fixed, the challenge was there to, uh, in relationship with the Philips engineers in France, uh, to design uh, the fixture further to a real uh, product. In a very short time, four weeks, uh, we developed together in a nice collaboration uh, a fixture and we noticed uh, um, or we touched each uh, borders of, uh, of flexibility and uh, creativity. Uh, the designer who wants to go always further, further design-wise and purify the aesthetics of the fixture and the engineer because of uh, the time pressure on his shoulders who wants to, uh, to fix uh, the design as, as, as uh, fast as possible uh, and uh, go back to uh, existing uh, principles of uh, light sources and uh, connections. So we found out there with making steps to each other's uh, world uh, we find out a new uh, fixture, what you can see uh, today. After this uh, intensive uh, collaboration, um, we are proud to work together with Philips City uh, of Almere City Tech, that we in this short time uh, can, uh, can show a result, uh, can show a fixture, 
where we have a very good feeling as designer that it's uh, a durable uh, design that will, uh, will fulfill the demands of the cities, the citizens, the users with a, a safe uh, uh, light, uh, with an, uh, an ambient uh, light and uh, what for the, the maintenance it's a, it's a positive uh, story but uh, price quality uh, I think a good, uh, a good balance. Uh, and, and we have a good feeling and we think Philips has also a good feeling.